second question, uh, Deputy Eamon Gilmore. Cancorla, Deputy Kenny <coughs> has rightly referred to the pattern of waste uh, that uh, has been taking place in the HSE and over which the government has presided uh, for years now. Uh, the latest example of which is contained in the uh, internal report which uh, was um, uh, presented by the, the HSE, uh, the audit of the skill programme administrative expenditure which will be considered by the Public Accounts Committee uh, tomorrow and for which uh, I uh, hope that there will be full accountability from the HSE uh, and uh, all of the organisations that were involved uh, in that episode. Uh, but there's another area of waste that I want to draw the Taoiseach's attention to and get some answers from him today. And that is the report that we had yesterday. The Department of Environment and Local Government uh, have now told us uh, that there is no purchaser uh, for the uh, wasted electronic voting machines uh, and that um, the state is not going to get uh, any of its money back uh, from the waste that was incurred uh, in that expenditure. At a time when uh, people are being asked to pay more and to endure more cuts as a result of the government's mismanagement of the economy and the, the banking crisis, I think people are increasingly, um, it's increasingly, increasingly unacceptable to people uh, to have these continuing wastes occurring and unaccounted for. In the case of the electronic voting machines, they were bought in 2004 by the government. 50 million euros was spent on it. Uh, they were never uh, used. Um, it was a waste, which was part of the pattern of waste that was occurring at that time. Uh, but this particular one didn't have to happen because the government was warned in advance by the Labour Party, by Fine Gael, by IT experts, by academics, that this was wasteful expenditure, that this voting system would not work and was unreliable and that it shouldn't be proceeded with. Nevertheless, Nevertheless, the government charged ahead, spent the 50, Deputy, spent the 50, million, spent the 50 million euro on it, now can't sell them, is spending something like 3 million euro, 3 million euro a year to keep them, uh, to, to keep them uh, stored in warehouses for which there are 20 or 25 year leases. Now I want to ask you Taoiseach, two questions in relation to it. First of all, will you confirm to the House this morning that the 50 million is gone and that we're not going to see it again and that as the spokesperson from the Department of the Environment said yesterday, uh, the money will not be recovered. And secondly, will you finally acknowledge, since nobody in government has ever acknowledged, that this was an appalling waste of money? Supplementary, Deputy Gilmore. <laughs> That's not true, Taoiseach. Um, the decision was not taken because all party agreement was not uh, obtained on it. The decision was taken because uh, a, an expert group was set up uh, to examine whether or not it was a reliable system and they found that it was just as dodgy, if not more dodgy and unreliable to use that electronic voting system uh, as uh, both Labour and Fine Gael pointed out to you when uh, the whole uh, exercise started. That's why the machines that's why the machines couldn't be used. Uh, it was an unreliable uh, system uh, and uh, it had to be abandoned. Nothing to do with, with all party agreement. It was a waste of money, Taoiseach. And it has cost the Irish taxpayer 50 million euro. Now I know when you, when you think, because your government thinks in billions, that 50 million euro may not amount to an awful lot. 50, billion, 50 million euro is what you are going to get back at 50 cents a time on the prescription charges that you're now charging uh, people on medical cards for two years. Your prescription charges will come in at 24 million for the year. So every medical card holder in this country is now paying 50 cents an item every time they go into a, a pharmacist to get their prescription written out and they'll be doing so for the next two years to pay back the 50 million that you wasted on electronic voting machines. And you know, it's about time 
that somebody over there, no minister was ever to, taken to account for it, nobody was ever sacked, nobody was ever chastised, the money was wasted, Taoiseach. And it's about time that you or somebody in the government had the good grace to stand up, say we at least say we made a mistake, the money is gone, say sorry to the, to the Irish people Question and down. accept the blame and accept the responsibility that you have for it.